namaste how are you welcome back welcome if you're new i am so foolish girl let's get into this reading and find out what you need to know right now oh okay that's too many definitely someone is thinking about your lips someone wants to okay <laughs> Mm, hopefully you want to kiss them back mm, okay yes someone needs you right now someone wants to tell you something that they've never told anyone someone wants to actually keep your secrets we have safe place okay someone wants to keep your secrets be there for you and I feel that this is a romantic interest okay if you are a masculine, this is a feminine. If you are a feminine, this is a masculine. This is romantic, okay? Especially if you like wearing the color black or the color white is significant here. Oh, okay. <laughs> I'm hearing like, yeah, they want to keep your secrets and they want to make you feel good at the same time. Seduction. Someone finds you irresistibly attractive. It could be your cologne, the way you look, the way you interact with them. It makes them actually, your seduction actually makes them feel safe, okay? Now, I am hearing something though, a little to the side. For some of you, there could be some sort of interference, but your person, they feel like you're their safe place. There, someone might be trying to, to seduce your person, okay? Ooh, one of the things that they love about you the most is how much you love yourself. So if you actually really love yourself, then hey, they're going to be all on you. Okay? I'm also hearing an apology. Someone wants to apologize to you. And on top of that, with this seduction card, I just keep being drawn to this. This seems like some sort of courtship, like something that is leading up to something. And it's like maybe you saying no to them, maybe you saying no to their advances, or maybe this person's doing that to you. Let me know. It's turning you on, okay? Someone is getting seduced here. I do feel that this is a mutual seduction, okay? For some of you, this could be same sex. Take it how it resonates. Ooh, okay. And I do feel like someone has been talking about you. Yes. Someone's been talking about you. We got gossip here. And I am feeling that they've been talking about you in a way like who does this person think they are you know like self-abundant like oh like listen you're a master manifester you can get anybody to find you attractive want to be in your energy want to be in your vibe so you don't have to care about the gossip on the side i'm also getting that this person could be afraid of gossip of someone getting in the business we are going to get some tarot and see what's going on don't believe the hype trust your intuition that's what i'm hearing look at that on the bottom of the deck partner in crime definitely this could be same sex but if it's not that's fine this person definitely wants you to keep keep their secrets and they just want to feel like they can tell you anything. They want somebody that they can really lean on. They don't want somebody who's going to tell their business. So, I don't know who this is for, but this is someone who lives a very private life. It seems like they're under a lot of stress. So, whatever they tell you, you know, somebody might go, maybe someone told you something and go back. Let's just get into the tarot and see what comes up. What else do you need to know? I definitely want to get a confirmation for what are they afraid of with this gossip. With this seduction, let's go with the seduction. I want to see what that's about. I knew it. Okay. 
if you're not dating this person this person wants to t to date you this person wants to have moon cycles with you this person could even want to procreate with you we see the rabbit the rabbit is good luck this person feels very lucky okay that you're in their energy this is the three of wands aries leo sagittarius energy it could be any sign it could be any sign if you're not dating, this person wants to date you. If you are dating, they feel like this connection, this vibe, whatever you guys have, this you're keeping them interested. It's never a dull moment with you is what I'm hearing. One more for this confirmation. Yes. Oh, okay. You might feel like this person sometimes isn't giving you the attention that you deserve or they could be a little bit manipulative now for some of you i am getting the vibe that this could be someone from your past okay a past energy and someone is mad that you're moving on i don't know who this is for you guys let me know gemini aquarius libra energy someone's mad big mad that you're moving on but let's see where you're going Who's coming in for you and just pissing off this this queen of swords reverse oh yeah i love this could be a king of swords could be could be any sign oh my goodness yes there's so much passion there's so much desire this electricity okay with this ace of wands a passionate new beginning they're over it. They're over all the, the 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 drama, all the fucking yapping and all that craziness. They're just over it. This person is definitely coming towards you. If they haven't already been in your energy, they're thinking about you. They could even be feeling inspired by you creatively in some way. Mm, this person wants you sexually so, so, so freaking bad. Like, I'm literally... I'm, I'm not gonna say that that's just so I can't I can't say that I can't say that um but they definitely they want to they want to get physical with you they want to get physical with you and they really do think about this they think about this a lot they think about and I I do feel that this could lead to something that is long term here with this partner in crime okay this could be long term oh the chemistry is off the chain if you haven't been around this person if you have not been in their energy this is what they think about they think about this a lot this is heavily on their mind to the point that it could be even making this person jealous yes why is this sticking I want to take this. This is the four of swords, reverse, Gemini, Aquarius, Libra. Yes, this person really is so afraid. Someone in the past really, like, kind of made this person mentally ill. They caused this person some sort of mental, um, I don't know, emotional trauma is what I'm hearing. Emotional trauma. And I think that's why they want you to be their safe place. But anyway... With this four of, four of Swords reverse, I do kind of feel like they want this to be public or maybe someone here quite possibly could be in the public eye or have a huge platform or something like that. They're, this person is really worried about what people are going to say, okay? They're in their head, but I do feel that they are going to sort of like make a move towards you or express their love for you this could even be expressing their love for you publicly in some way i'm getting so so many like i'm getting so much information from, from this reading i definitely know that this person feels like they're afraid to lose you and quite possibly if you were to walk away from them that would be a problem they wouldn't be able to deal with that energy cancer pisces scorpio energy i was seeing the eight of cups Yes, this has been a long time. Maybe you two have been waiting for each other. Maybe this person is just taking their time. But let me tell you, do you see how this Knight of Pentacles is dancing, like chilling, having a great time? Okay. <sighs> because they are like, mm hmm, I know you've been waiting, but it's going to be worth the wait. I got something for your ass when I see you. Okay. 
the Knight of Pentacles is the most promising knight, and he's coming with some type of physical love offer. This person could be wanting to see you, actually physically see you if you haven't seen them. They could be planning to purchase something with you, bring you something, gift you something, give you something that you can taste, touch, and feel, and I do mean that in that way, okay? <laughs> I hope you like foreplay because there's going to be a lot of it. There's going to be, this is going to be a foreplay dream come true, okay? <laughs> like with the person that's, that's so hot. Let's see how you're feeling about this person. I just want to kind of tap into your energy and see how you feel about this person. If, if this is someone new coming in... that you've never met before. Maybe this part is not for you, but it will still be for you because it's gonna be how you feel. So, let's see. How are you feeling about this person? Okay, so we do have the lovers refers. You kind of feel like this person's not into you, okay? <laughs> Which is hilarious. The lovers. This is Gemini. This is a major arcana. I'm very relieved to see that we only have one so far. So that's telling me that all of this energy is present. Okay. This is current energy. You kind of feel like this person is into you. But I'm telling you this person is absolutely into you. This person cannot stop thinking about you. This person actually feels seduced by you. And they feel like you could very well be their, um, I don't know, creative inspiration in some way. Let's get some more and see how you feel about this person. Just a couple more. I really like this reading. Oh, this is a new deck and it's just like, I want the top card. We have two. These are stuck together. Um, the Seven of Swords and the Eight of Wands reversed. Yeah, the communication is kind of... Um, the communication is off. It's like maybe you know that this person is interested in you, but the communication sucks. <laughs> um, there could be some delays in traveling. I am noticing this... I hear this all-seeing eye, this all-knowing eye. Maybe some of you have been seeing this. Your intuition is right. Trust your intuition. You know, God is intervening. The divine is intervening. Your higher self is intervening. With the Seven of Swords, yeah, this person, I, I do feel as though you're, you're like, you just want them to lay all their cards out. You just want them to be straight up. That's it. That's, what, that's the way, that's the vibe, all right? Mm, let's get specific. Let's get one more card about how you feel. And then I think I want to do some more love messages or something to see. Oh my goodness. You definitely feel like this is your perfect, perfect, perfect match. But you feel like this is just... You feel like this is going to be a miracle. Um, you want this person to see you. You're hoping that they see you because... You feel like you have such good chemistry. You're also worried about time. Maybe you feel like this is taking too long or something with this Knight of Pentacles, but it's not. It's it's going. It's it's in divine order because because of this all-seeing eye. There's some some sort of divine intervention. I'm I'm hearing a lot of messages about. I guess this is coming through from my higher self to yours. Relax. You know, don't worry about the timing. You have more than enough timing. You have more than enough timing. This person is taking their time with you for a reason. Just relax and allow the universe, allow the, everything to unfold with the Temperance card. Could be Sagittarius, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Okay, so let's see how are they currently feeling about you? Because I felt like the first half was more of a general. And what do they want to say? I'm going to pull some cards about what they want to say to you. 
Oh, five of swords. You have this person straight confused. Straight confused. So I feel like maybe there is some sort of mirroring energy going on here. There is a major miscommunication. But once you guys get that out of the way. <laughs> yes, I'm hearing, I'm hearing that um that foreplay gonna be off the chain. Okay, there could definitely be some sort of physical distance between you guys Pisces energy Gemini Aquarius Libra energy Let's tap in and see what this person wants to What are they thinking about when it comes to you when it comes to this connection? Let's just get straight down to it. What are their thoughts? I'm gonna pull some more cards because I definitely am getting a lot of channel messages. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. From the, from the beginning of this reading, we have safe place and now we have seek professional advice. You cannot make this stuff up at all. It's insane. Like I said, they want to be able to tell you their secrets and it not go anywhere, okay? And you could be healing to this person. I feel like there's something about you that is healing. And even in the way that, oh my goodness, Ace of Pentacles. I love this. We have the Ace of Pentacles and we also have the Ace of Wands. You're about to get your boo thing, okay? Your boo thing is coming in, coming through for you. You guys are going to work through this situation. They want to offer you something physically, materially, and emotionally they they this could even be marriage the seek professional advice this could be the Hierophant Taurus energy that's traditional values that's I do feel that they have been talking to someone maybe that's where that gossip is coming from as well they have been talking to someone about you because this is turning into some I just said that I said that a million times I said I'm coming trust my question to you is, are you ready? Because this person is coming for you. You're constantly on their mind. Don't doubt this energy. Don't doubt this energy, okay? Do not doubt. And some of you, you, you are master manifestors. You manifested this. You've literally manifested your soulmate out of thin air. This is something that's going to take place really quickly after a long sort of courtship. Yes, think before you act, exactly. They're being very cautious because they're serious about this connection. They're serious about you. If this person made any sort of declarations to you or, mm, okay, for some of you, if they, if they meant what they said and they said something that hurt you, Think before you act. This person is thinking. They're thinking, okay? They're thinking and it really has a lot to do with being rejected, okay? But I don't think that this person wants to reject you. I think this person could even be secretively in love with you, okay? So you guys let me know how that works out. I definitely wanna get some more. And I just split the deck, I need more balance. There's a lot going on in this energy. Like I said, this person could be really active socially and just have a lot on their plate in general. This is a thinker. This is someone who's always in their head. So let's see what they wanna say. What do they want to say to you right now? What do they want to say? Oh, I love it. Okay. I dream about you constantly. I hate that I have to wake up because it's so beautiful in the 5D. Oh, uh, that's so lit. They're literally dreaming about you. And... I just said that I believe I just said this person is constantly in their head about you so for this five for this energy for some of you this could really be there could be some distance between you 
there could be some distance between you or maybe you haven't spoken to this person in a while but you should be seeing signs and synchronicities at this point and when you are seeing those signs and synchronicities it's because this person is truly thinking of you especially if you're 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 dreaming about them too right you could be dreaming about them but they're definitely dreaming about you I'm not happy in my current situation. I'm miserable without you. So I don't know if this person is in a connection or in a relationship. I don't know. Um, it, this doesn't have to be that they're in a relationship. It could just be like maybe they moved or they relocated and there's distance between you. Whatever it is, they're not happy. They are miserable without you. Just know that. And, and this person is coming towards you they are coming towards you let's see what else i just want one card i want a second chance not being with you is killing me i really feel like that's a microphone drop right there okay <laughs> Mm -mm. And I definitely feel like this person has been talking about you to some of their close friends. But, you know, you don't have to be worried about this person as much because you are this person's safe place. And, yeah, they want a second chance. They want reconciliation. They want your forgiveness. And... If you've not been with this person, they want a second chance at love, okay? They want to be in your energy. They want to be next to you. They want to hold you. They want to kiss you. They want to keep your secrets, okay? Safe place. I love it. That's the wave. That's the vibe. I'll see you guys in your next reading. Until then, namaste.